they had come to the far edge of the Great Plains in search of a new beginning in the last place in America where a family could claim a homestead and build a future. We had the best crop that we had had in 1929 and everything was looking up. A sea of grass, once the domain of Indians and buffalo, disappeared beneath the blade of a plow. I saw the whole country transformed in the sunset glow. All the brown prairie turned to gold. But then it was as if the land rejected them. The rains stopped and the winds came. We saw this cloud coming in, black, black dirt. And I'll never forget my grandmother. She said, you kids run and get together. The end of the world's coming. It came like a black wall, a tide of destruction that crashed over the broken plains, choking the life out of everything in its path. You never really escaped the dust. It always found its way in. And that's, I think, what drove people crazy. Some would pull up stakes and move on, but most stayed, always looking to the promise that next year would be better. We were just too selfish and we were trying to make money, and it didn't work out. Ken Burns tells the story of a generation that was buried and what it took to dig out.